Hello. <laughs> yep. Whoop. Yeah. I'm like breathe. <laughs> really? Nearly there, mate. Yeah. Man, them legs oh, are the scary. Bring it on. Put them legs away, you're scaring everyone. <laughs> We're on you, up. <laughs> Jesus, man! It's only me. You right? Yeah, I felt somebody in front of me. Well, this is the bad point, isn't it? Really? It's back there. It's just sort of like a hit of the wall. You right, not far there. Hello, mate. I thought Ify was just waving at me as she was walking past, yeah. but she was feeling in front of her, so I said hello, she went past and she just screamed. But I thought she was waving at me because I thought yeah. everyone knew I was here, like you did, yeah. but obviously not. <laughs> so um, when you see her, offer my apologies, I didn't mean to scare her. Come on in then guys! Yeah, come in into the centre here. It's quite good tonight actually because there's not much um, water. Because we've been fairly dry recently, it's um, the water table seems quite uh, dry. So you're not getting the drips on the head. No, exactly. So I think that's really going to help tonight, you know. So uh, hopefully we'll have a good night. Excellent. So I just need to to introduce yourselves, you two, and uh, you'll see yourself on candid camera. So firstly, you've just done a walk through uh, the tunnel. First impressions, Jason, what do you think? Nothing here. Nothing here? Okay, how about you? I think I'm in agreement, perhaps it's because there's quite a few people here, so it's probably difficult to pick up. Okay. Hear voices and things, so. All right. Okay. Nothing at all, no? No. Right, let's go to someone else. Who else have we got here, then? Hello. Hello. What do you think? Anything? Nothing so far. Nothing so far? 
Hello. Hello. What do you think? It's a frightening place. Um, it's scary, obviously, because it's dark, but uh, nothing really so far. Okay. Just that kind of looking over your shoulder, thinking there's someone behind you feeling. But Just because it's dark, yeah? Possibly, yeah. Okay. Miffy. <laughs> <laughs> so it's no good walking away. You are going to get captured. Where are you? I'm here. All right. So what, what do you think? Well, you've been here before anyway. Yeah. But anything um, going on or is it quiet at the moment? It's quiet for me at the moment because I'm not open, but from the, the lone walk through, I think um, it's psychological. Yeah. And hitting that, that sudden wall of black. Okay. Yeah. All right. Yeah. Steve? Hello, Byron. Uh, my first time here, actually. So, uh, very nice. Very dark. Um, Quite sure, as yet. It's a bit early, day, early days, yeah. It's probably the uh, the total blackness before you turn the corner of the tunnel, but yes. Yeah. Yeah, it's a nice place. Well, oh, I've done you. You have. Who haven't I done? Hello. Uh, hello. Right, what do you think? Um, Dark. Beautiful. Um, I didn't pick anything up on the way because I was so scared, but coming back through, I picked something up. All right. So, do you want to tell us what it was? Uh, well, <laughs> I feel really silly. Um, I picked up a male. Okay. I'll tell you what he's wearing. I'll tell you what he looks like. Go on then. Um, he's got a beard, he's got very white hair, and he's got a white shirt on, and he's got um, a waistcoat, and the buttons are undone on his waistcoat. How far up the tunnel was that? Okay. Nice man or a bad man? Nice. Okay. Right. Well, so far, that's what I've not. Stayed around. Right. Beauty. Who else we got? Barry. Hi. Come on then. Uh, on my walk through, um, I felt the presence of a, of a man uh, and he was actually walking with me. Right. Uh, from at least uh, a quarter of the way into the tunnel all the way to the end. Um, I, he, he did, he wasn't, I couldn't describe him properly but I could feel that he was next to me. On the return visit, on the return coming back, Again, he was walking beside me, so okay. it might develop into something else later on this evening. Where, who was with you? Andy? Not got anything yet, by the way. Nothing at all? Quiet? Yeah. Yeah. Julie. Julie. Oh. Julie, sorry. Hello. Right, what, what's happening? No, nothing. Yeah. Nothing? No. Quiet? Yeah. Happy to stay here on your own, then? No. <laughs> I'm a scaredy well, cat. I'm, here. What are you to be of? I'm no. a scaredy cat. No, okay. Well, like I say, I think at the moment, Ali. I did feel something on the way through, but I don't know whether I should say it with everybody <coughs> here, and I've not been here before. So. No, say it now, because you might as well say it. As I walked up, I felt like there was, I mean, it's difficult to describe, a little withered man huh? and some connection with a little boy, and it's like the withered man was like. This is my space, and I don't want you in it. And the little boy was frightened of this little withered man. How far down the tunnel was this? Well, it was before I got to Nigel's cameras, and it was on the left-hand side. Okay. <coughs> I don't feel anything. When do I ever feel anything? <laughs> Apart from when they tug my leg. I'm sorry. Just I did, for the benefit of uh, everybody out there, would you go out with a man like this? Go on, pull him up. <laughs> Look at him, star guru. <laughs> just those guys on the outside of the circle, just send the energy back towards these sensitive people in the beginning. Those guys in the circle inside the sensitive, so I just want you to call out, really, for the piece, the person that was here. We know there was a guy here. But I want you to do it in your minds. All right, and I want you to bring those ideas in and just call out what you get. Okay, if there's any person here, any spirit person that wishes to communicate with those people in this tunnel today, then step forward and make yourself known to us. What did you hear then? There was like a, a whiny murmur behind yeah, us. Yeah. I, I thought it was children's voices. Okay, just, just keep quiet and see what we can pick up. Have we got someone down there? Okay. Go and check on the kid. If that was you, can you step forward?
Yeah. Techies, what do you think? It has got cold, but the wind speed's gone up to about 5.6 5. now. Train! Yeah. 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 Hmm? You're feeling angry. You're feeling angry? Very angry. Oh, okay. Oh, you're shaking. Yeah, well, I'm getting sort of, I think I'm getting sort of a heel up. Byron, taste it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm here, why? No, I mean, taste it to see if I can feel it. Okay. Yeah. Alright. Yeah. Can we switch the off of the soft in the next? Peter. 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 Right. Peter. Just, just switch them off in the next? Okay. Okay. If you're here with us, step forward now and make yourself known. Let us know if you are here. If your name's Peter, can you come forward? Don't hang around in the sides, just step forward, bring yourself right to the centre of this circle. Can you see me? Are you scared of us? Are you angry? Graham, I think you need to come out, mate. Okay, EVP session closed. <coughs> <laughs> so come on, then we've just done the first EVP session yeah, at 10 while, past 10. While you were, I heard that, what everybody else heard over the other side of the tunnel, um, but I was right back up against the wall away from everybody, I was looking up the tunnel, and as you were asking the questions, I swear I heard, and I felt somebody standing, a good few feet away from me, and away from everybody, but I could hear... Like, not clothing, I don't know, but just a sound of, of, of movement. Not on the floor, gravel or anything, and I could obviously hear the drips of rain, but I could definitely, f it felt like there was something there, and I could feel like, like I said like movement of clothes, but it wasn't yeah. coming from anybody, because I had my head turned up again, up towards the end of the tunnel, and not towards anybody in the circle. But it did freak me out just a little bit. How hey, hey, about the person sat next to you? Did you catch anything there? Me? Um, no, but I, I did think it was quite eerie when the wind picked up as soon as we started yeah. doing the seance or whatever. Yeah, it. yeah. Um, and it seemed sort of automatic as soon as the group got in a circle, you know, the wind, the wind picked, picked up, up quite fast. And Where's I did feel like there was something behind me. Right. Um, I kept, constantly kept looking behind me, but I, mm. you know, couldn't see anything. Yeah. Really when you just, no. Okay. Hey, Where is your go again? So did, you, did you get anything? I was just to keep getting that man. Okay, so he's been around. Mm -hmm. But did you hear any voices in, in the EVP session? No. Okay, so Graham did, but it's sort of more or less on the other side, I think. Him and the back of him. Yeah. Anyway, this is HD on the trip out. Everyone all right? Yeah, no, I'm fine. You're right, Tonya. No, I'm okay. I've just got this real. I keep getting this static thing on my hair for a start, which it keeps just sticking to me. Um, I just, I, I've got a real fear of being here. Just really, I feel really vulnerable and. I don't know. Yeah, no, I'm fine. I'm fine. I'm Where the tunnel was, we more the centre tunnel, I would say, wouldn't you? Mm. We were. Um, we heard a few things. One of them was like a heartbeat, wasn't it? Mm. Especially heard like a heartbeat. Mm -hmm. All of us heard that sort of sound. Um, but for some reason, I was drawn to this part of the tunnel, and I explained to you others that it felt like a wall. Like some like spirits will will go up to that point and won't go past that point. 
So what? So we say, well, what, what we've decided is to walk to this side. So we've gone through this that wall area, and we'll see. We're going to see if we can pick anything up okay. in this side of the, the part of the tunnel. If there's a spirit person standing behind me, do you want to step into the circle, step forward, and communicate with us? Do we want to find out about you? We want to find out who, your name, why you're here, did you work here, did you die here? We want to know everything about you. Please step forward and communicate with us. Use our energy. Step into the circle and use our energy. Thank you. I'm sure. I got the, when we were here earlier, I got the name John Adams. I just said John. John Adams. Ali, what did I say? I said Jane, didn't We I? got, um, la last time, Faye, it was John Adams. Really? Yeah. I said that. It was an Adams, yeah. Yeah. Because I wasn't sure if it was Adam. The, and, then, and then I got yeah. Adam's son, so I thought they were like... The names we picked up before, John Adams, he was a bearded John chap. Son. Big beard. Oh, yeah. And Ali, your leg thing, and, and also Barry. The, the last time we came here, um, round about this area, someone lost their, basically both their legs, actually, in, in an accident. In an explosion? No, there was a, the, the actual railway was running at that time, and he was on the line, basically, and lost both legs. The guy, uh, you get him, and the angriness is coming from that guy, because he wanted to know why he had to die, you know? So I think that might explain some of Miffy's yeah. anger, apart from the fact that she... Building, building, wanted to really... Yeah. Ah, that kind of feel. Oh, my heart was pounding. You all right, Ali? Yeah, my legs are just so... It's like I can't support my weight. OK. <laughs> all right, I, I get a... Um, Picture when we were standing in a group, there's a man in the middle and he's really big, he's really tall, he's very angry, he's got his sleeves rolled up to here, he's got big like forearms, it's like, reminds me a bit like Popeye, that kind of big, and he's he's looking at everybody and he's he's like, Who are you? Who are you? And who are you? So when you started saying that if you feel like people want to be split up, he wants to that's how I feel. You want I feel really angry at the moment. And I just want to say, get that fucking camera out of my face. But, that, but that's not me. Yeah. I feel, and he's, and he's like, and he's smiling. And he's like, yes. get out of my way. I've got work to do. And it's, it's just this whole. That's it. But um, I don't want to. I don't want to say anymore. Pick that up down there. Um, Mark, I said to you. Yes, you did. Snarly. Yes. Bare yes. teeth. Yes. He's really angry. He's got, he hasn't got much hair. I don't get. I don't think he's got much hair in his face. And he's got these big, wide eyes. Right, I don't think I didn't get that, it was just the emotion. Unusual. And uh, we were doing a call in eight, and someone basically started pushing down on my shoulders, uh, uh, you know, really pushing down. And it was almost like, well, was it you, Barry, who said they were trying to, well, they're trying to separate. That's what the, the sensation well, I got. Well, you, it was almost trying to pull the thing out. Yeah, exactly. So it was a little bit odd. <laughs> Barry is on the opposite side as me, and he was getting the same sort of thing. It's almost like someone pulled through me to get to Barry or, or vice versa. So I think we'll carry on here and I'll see what we get. If everyone's all right. And Ali, tell them about your legs. My legs feel like they've been wrenched out of their sockets to the point that I couldn't even stand up just a minute ago I had to bend down. I can't describe it any more than that, but when I left the tunnel earlier, it went and I've come back in and it's absolutely agony again. And I also saw a figure up there earlier and Louise saw it as well. I saw a pair of legs on the way up. Just a chat. I said end of chat. I mean not not seven legs or anything like that, yeah, just yeah. you know, the bottom of somebody's legs. My legs. 
I've got one voice exactly the same. My hips are like really hurt. Yeah, mine's not. I've done this because it's going out at the back of my leg. The back of my leg. Mm, it's quite common. Is it? I don't really Legs want to hear being that. touched. Yeah, I don't really want to hear that. Okay, do something to Jason, please. <laughs> <laughs> Hit it really hard. <laughs> <laughs> Why don't you just get what you want? I've had something four times. I had something like a vibration touch on my jacket just here. Okay. Cool, if that's you, then step forward again, step into the circle. Are you angry with us? Are you angry with us? Well, I don't think he's very happy, however it is. I said that, my head's gone up again. I just saw a light right up a few of them, up, up on the ceiling. Really? I've got proper, like, charged, or all, my whole body, like, I've got goosebumps in my whole body, and I know it's cold and stuff, but it's, it's not that cold, is it? No. Are you alright, Barry? Yeah. Oh, it's just it. something yeah. is here, something, something's here right now. Should we let someone in the circle then? Yeah. Should we break the circle yeah, then? Someone break it, break it. Let the person in. Right, if this. <laughs> just step forward now. If you're the person that's angry with us, we're not leaving, we're staying. So you either have to put up with it or step away. Yeah, yeah but I don't think this thing's very nice either. I think this is almost like it's taunting. And again, you know that feeling we had earlier on with people sort of being pulled away from the circle? Yeah, I agree. Okay, I, I think actually we're going to close this down now because mm. this is getting a bit weird. So is he inside the circle or is he out here with me then? I don't know, but my heart's fucking like in the think he's on the inside. Nigel, you'll be alright mate, you've got a camera. Yeah. Nigel, is something on your camera flashing? Because sort of three times I've seen like a flash in your chair. Um, only when it records the disc. It We'll flash red um, now and again. Yeah, that's, it's a white flash in your shadow. No, no white light. Are we going to break this Yeah, I, I think we're going to go and leave and close down properly because I think this is a little bit weird. I, I don't like the energy that's here now. I don't like this uh, thing that's here with us. I, I think we should go. What's your answer? I'm not. You're not? I don't know. Tonya. Right, okay. mm -hmm. Step away. Step, step away. away. Step okay, whoever's away. here, step back. Step back. Step back. Move back. Okay, step back. You just put your hands on top of Nick's head here. On the head? Yeah, on the head. Let's go on the head, alright? Okay, step back. Move away. Maybe, alright? Okay. You okay? Alright. What did you see? What did you see? Nothing. I'm just feeling extremely angry. Really? Okay. And my heart hurts. Okay, I think we should leave and get Miffy out of this location, all right? Um, you take take her down. Can we take her down, get her out. And okay. we'll bring the kit down and we'll leave now. Please time to go. Come on. Miffy, what happened? Was it bad? No, it wasn't, but it was. It's bizarre. <laughs> You're just a bit angry. You, you seem to have taken on the shape of someone else.
Um, well, when we were speaking to you, you just weren't there. No, I, I, this is what I was saying to the others. I, as, as the seance was going on, I felt um, like I was observing, but I didn't see myself observing. I just felt distant. Okay. And I didn't feel any anger, I didn't feel any emotion, but um, there was this gradual just pressing on my, my heart in the chest. And um, then the anger started to build, and I was just trying to channel it down, because all I wanted to do was vocalise it. Mm. And um, it just became quite uncomfortable. And was, then, was, did you get any solace from the people around you? I mean, did it help when those oh, guys yeah. came in? Yeah, but I couldn't move. Come in, Barry. Spot. Just, what? I mean, you were there, so... Yeah, uh, I mean, obviously I put my hand on with his head. Um, and what I felt was, like, like after a um, ten-second sort of thing, the spirits come from her, but it felt yeah. like there was more than one. Uh, it's like if there's a couple of them who combine their energies up, so obviously, perhaps their engine's maybe weak now. Uh, that's what. I, that's the sort of thing that which I felt. Okay. But you're all right now, Miffy. Yeah. Thank you. Cup of tea, slice of cake, yeah. and so on. At the beginning of the evening, Jason. It was quiet, so it's still pretty quiet. But uh, what? How was it for you? Um, yeah, it's been very good. So the biggest part of the evening for me was hearing that voice say yes. Um, it's, it's the clearest voice I've heard on an investigation. Okay. Um, I did come in and spend 15 or so minutes in the tunnel on my own, so um, I'm hoping that I might have picked up some EVPs, but uh, it's been a really enjoyable evening. Okay, and the boss? Yeah, definitely. <laughs> the boss? It's a bit scary when Jason and I went off together. I, I thought I felt something touch my leg, but I think it's probably just my imagination. And then I, I felt like a buzz go up through my leg, my left leg, if that makes any sense, which it doesn't really, but that was a bit scary. And I did find my legs ache as well. Because obviously, yeah. when, we, when we were stood in the circle doing it. Yeah, maybe it's, so, we are stood for a long time, but. Yeah, perhaps that's what it was. Yeah. So. I feel okay now, I've sat down for a bit. Okay. Alright, where's Tonya? You were involved in the incident with Miffy there. I mean, obviously, for me, when you came into that circle, that little group, did you feel anything at all yourself coming from Miffy? Um, I, I, I mean, she was immensely cold and shaking. Um, energy wise, I was focusing more on the energy I, we were all putting into her, so I, I didn't really sort of pick up on anything. From her, so yeah. So. Okay. It's been an interesting. interesting. Where's Andy? <laughs> yeah, mate. Right. Well, you were involved in that last little thing as well. Do you feel anything yourself? Um, not on that. Not during that piece now. Um, have you had anything in the evening? I have. I've um, said it to um, Nigel already, but about okay. touching on my left shoulder. Um, but during the set, during that time, I was very drawn to the entrance at that, okay. that end of the tunnel, yeah. feeling there was something there watching us. Um, I also felt that when we let the first, we told the first entity to come into the circle and open the circle to let them in. I felt there was also someone behind us or right. behind us that wasn't happy with that and didn't want that to happen. Okay. As if, um, I don't know, as if the, as if the person that had come into the circle was then out of his control, if you understand what I mean. Yeah, 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 yeah. But that's so it's almost like it's hiding, I suppose. Yeah. yeah. That's all I'm about. Chaps, how are we getting on? Everyone all right? Yeah, good. Cool. Everyone happy? Yes. Tired. Good night out. Good night. First night. What a, what a night to spend on a Saturday night, isn't it? Yeah. Never mind. Where's Big Grey? Hello. Sum up. I've got a cough. And I spoiled it for everybody tonight, I'm sorry about that. Um, 
really, really good night, apart from my horrible cough. But um, I think um, what everybody would say so far is the highlight has been um, when you started doing that EVP session, the first question you asked got a definitive response of a yes. And uh, so, it's goodbye from us then, yeah. isn't it, really? Thanks Short for coming, tunnel, everyone. 2010, what day is it? 10th of July. Yeah, we'll be back. Signing out. And the whole thing gives away. So Team. Good night, everyone. To the camcorder. Wave. Bye. 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 Bye.